person and I adopt the personality that resides in my spirit as my true personality. That's the story of the Christian life. It's exchange, not change. Okay? That's number one. I'm telling you about that life. When Jesus said, I said, Father sent me. So I live by him. So this definition of life was living the Father. And that was the summary of Paul's experience. It's no longer I. It's no longer I. I was the one that wanted to be a lecturer. And the reason why I wanted to be a lecturer was because I could cram. So I wanted to come to the class without notes and just give them notes, give them notes, give, draw diagrams, draw. That's the fallen man. That's how he thinks. He thinks of vainglory. Thinks of me. I must be on the stage. Everyone must know that I am sound. That's how the fallen man thinks. But the man in Christ doesn't mind to be hidden. If only God will see him and be pleased, it's okay. Yes. It's no longer I. The regime of the fallen self, it ended so that I can leave Christ. He now revealed to us what living meant for him. He said, for me to leave is Christ. He's giving expression to the person that is trapped on my heart. It is my obligation to reveal him through my thoughts, through my act. That's life. 